Hi guys, welcome back to Higo Spot's channel. Everyone may somehow forget their iPhone 11 passcodes. When your iPhone 11 says iPhone unavailable and you couldn't recall your passcode, don't panic, you can still unlock it with the methods we provided in this video. There is one thing you need to know before you unlock your iPhone 11. That is, you have to perform a factory reset on your iPhone 11 to unlock it. After the factory reset, all your settings will be reset to their default options, and all the data including photos, videos, music, files and more will be erased. Despite that, if you have a backup available in iCloud or your computer, you can restore it when setting up your iPhone 11. Now let's start our work. The Erase iPhone option is a new feature developed for the iOS device that is running iOS 15.2 or later. If your iPhone 11 hasn't developed to iOS 15.2 or newer, you can skip to the next method. Also, your iPhone 11 should be connected to a network and your Apple ID password is needed in this process. Continue to input the wrong passcode until the screen appears, iPhone unavailable, or security lockout. You can then find the Erase iPhone option at the right bottom and tap on it. Tap on Erase iPhone again to confirm the erasing. Then, enter your Apple ID password to sign out and tap Erase. The reset will then begin itself. If you don't have the Erase iPhone option on your iPhone, iPhone Unlocker can help you. It is a software designed to solve iPhone passcode problems. With iPhone Unlocker, you can easily unlock your iPhone 11 within a few clicks. Input www.appgeeker.com into a blank website, you can also find it in the description below. On appgeeker.com, you can find iPhone Unlocker in the product list, click it and download the iPhone Unlocker. After downloading is done, open iPhone Unlocker on your computer. Click the blue white passcode option in the interface. Then, connect your iPhone to the computer. If your iPhone is not detected, click the device connected but not recognized link and follow the guide to put your iPhone 11 into recovery mode. After filling in the blank with your iPhone 11 information, click Start. The firmware will start downloading, wait for a while. When it's done, enter 0000 and click Unlock. You may now leave the software to carry out its tasks and make sure the internet is stable during the reset. Your iPhone 11 will no longer be unavailable now, you can set it up and restore your backup if you have one. To use the iCloud Find My feature, your iPhone 11 should have opened Find My iPhone before and it should be connected to a Wi-Fi or cellular network. Also, your Apple ID and password for the unavailable iPhone 11 is also needed. First, go to iCloud.com on a website and sign in with the Apple ID and password your unavailable iPhone used. Next, click on Find iPhone at the bottom right. Then, click All Devices and select the locked iPhone 11. Click on the rubbish bin icon to erase iPhone and choose Erase to confirm the unlocking process. Your iPhone is now being reset. Unlock an unavailable iPhone 11 with iTunes is one method encouraged by Apple. You can use a computer to put your iPhone into recovery mode and reset it with iTunes. Before you reset the iPhone with iTunes, there are some preconditions you need to notice first. Make sure the latest version of iTunes is downloaded on your computer. If you're using a PC, it has to be Windows 10 or later. A compatible USB cable is also required. If you are qualified with the conditions, follow the steps to reset your iPhone. Download the latest version of iTunes on your computer and open it. 
Unplug the iPhone 11 from the computer if it's plugged. Next, turn off your iPhone 11, here's how to do it. Press the volume down and the side button together, when the power off slider shows up, drag it. Then, put your iPhone 11 into recovery mode by the following steps. Long hold the side button and connect your iPhone 11 to the computer at the same time. Hold the button until the recovery mode screen appears. In iTunes, click Restore in the pop-up window. Click Restore and Update after reading the warning. The restore process will begin. When it's done, your iPhone is no longer locked, and you can set it up as you wish. That's all for today's video. If the video can help you with your problem, please hit the like button and subscribe to us for more latest videos. If you got any questions, you are welcome to leave a message in the comments, and we will reply to you as soon as we receive it. Thank you for watching. See you next time.